The goal of this meeting is to address the topic of integrating pedagogical diversity, blended learning and educational impact. We want to be able to give students and empower them to have the methodology for self-learning. One of the interpretations is really combining uh, in-class teaching with uh, online modules. Today I would like to share with you the idea of the MOOC that we have been created in uh, uh, Polytechnique, at the Ecole Polytechnique. It's a MOOC on the French language and how to acquire uh, the language and the culture for students from all over the world. Today what we hope to do is to broaden and expand that definition of blended learning so as to incorporate diversification of pedagogical formats um, including different uh, assessment methods so as to add new layers to enrich the learning experience for both teachers and students. I also think there are very interesting ways to blend the scales of interaction so blending a lecture with two or three hundred people together with small interactive practical workshops and then finally with plenty of capacity to have one-to-one -one conversations. Social theory is something very abstract. In order to uh, uh, engage the students you need to use blended learning. You need to use innovative techniques, experiential learning connected to their lives. In my case, I'm a professor of history and in my particular case, my presentation is about the use of the photography. But not the photography just as an illustration of the past or as an element that accompanies a text sino la fotografía como un lenguaje en sí mismo que nos permite transportarnos hacia el pasado y mostrar a nuestros estudiantes que el pasado sigue vivo en el presente. We've also talked about the importance of um, working on the diversification of assessment at the program level and uh, finally uh, we've discussed a specific example of techniques to improve students' writing skills. And I see the resonance in the you know sharing by the other colleagues in other universities. So what was interesting for me is we really live in one world, don't we? Science.